I actually trained out in Birmingham, and I, I was a fellow down there, and I probably do 150 Tommy Johns a year, uh, from the major league player all the way down to the uh, high school, and in some cases, unfortunately, before they get to high school. And it's all about education. It's educating the parents and the coaches, again, on pitch counts, not to fatigue themselves, to developing their shoulder and their core body strength, the motion and flexibility of their core body, the strength of their core body, the shoulder, to keep the shoulder in excellent condition, excellent motion, excellent strength of the 22 muscles of the shoulder so you're not placing undue stress on the elbow. And in learning the progression on when to start throwing breaking balls, curve balls, sliders, split fingers, and it's not only when to throw them at, at a young age when bef after the, the body has matured and your growth plates have closed, but it's all, and because that'll catch up with you. You're not going to hurt your elbow as a 13-year-old, but you could blow it out as a 15, 16, or 17-year-old. And so it's not only understanding when to throw them, but what I like to preach is have somebody teach you how to throw them the correct way. Not just in the backyard picking it up and trying to spin a ball. Have an expert teach you how to do this. We're not going to prevent Tommy John surgery altogether, but we can diminish the numbers that have Tommy John surgery by education. Thank you.